when we first came, I was jobless, carless, and friendless. I had no family to support me and my kids. Um, and while being here, I was able to get not only one job, but three jobs. So I would hit up every place, even if I didn't want to work there, just to get my foot in the door to the working world, you know? Because I hadn't worked for, you know, at least four years, three years. Yeah, I was a stay-at-home mom. <laughs> my dog, Chip, she was with us during this journey and um, she is my little chihuahua, she's 12, and she was my emotional support animal, still is. She helps me, um, she cheers me up because with her being there, I know I can't freak out too bad because it scares her and honestly, like I just treated her just like she's my oldest. <laughs> the shelter provided my house to be fully furnished um, from donors and we just acquired everything we needed throughout with the help of everyone here. So with the YWCA, there's a daycare program called My Friend's House and that's where my kids went and they loved it. And from being a stay-at-home mom to working three jobs, I didn't have um, a lot of time away from my kids and they had no problem adjusting to it and they just they they love it they loved it there they felt they felt safe they felt like you know they could talk to them now they're you know enrolled in school for the first year link is a program offered by um, the YWCA and it's an empowering class for women who have suffered um, abuse and it's to, it's to build your confidence to get back what was taken from you. And I had the confidence to go back to school. I re-enrolled into to college, the community college here. And you can go attend classes as much as you want. And I'm gonna go back to re-attend the classes because I just loved it. The advocates don't do things for you. I mean, they'll give you a number if you need it or, but they don't give you everything and so I came with the mentality I need to be the one to get a job I need to be the one to get daycare and I need to be the one I need to do it I need to do it and they they just held my hand while I climbed the stairs but I, I ended up climbing them by myself and I feel so much better knowing that I did it and not it wasn't a handout <laughs> thank you